Hello everyone. Today, I'll be discussing a significant yet complex issue, the socio-environmental impacts of dam construction in river basins. While dams play a crucial role in irrigation, hydropower generation, and flood control, their development often triggers a series of social and environmental conflicts that challenge the very sustainability they aim to achieve. 1. The socio-environmental conflicts Dams alter the natural flow of rivers, affecting not only ecosystems but also local livelihoods. River basins such as the Narmada in India, the Mekong in Southeast Asia, and the Amazon in South America have witnessed major disputes between development authorities, local communities, and environmental groups. At the heart of these conflicts lies a fundamental question. Who benefits from the dam and who bears the cost? While urban centers and industries enjoy electricity and water supply, rural and tribal populations often face eviction, loss of land, and cultural displacement. These imbalances create social tensions, protests, and long-term conflicts between people and policymakers. 2. Displacement and loss of livelihood Large dam projects often require submerging vast areas of land, leading to the displacement of thousands of families. Historically, rehabilitation and compensation efforts have been inadequate or delayed. Displacement doesn't just mean losing a home, it means losing ancestral land, community identity and access to natural resources like fisheries and farmlands. The Narmada Bachao Andolan in India is a key example of people's resistance against forced displacement without fair resettlement. 3. Ecosystem, Fragmentation and Biodiversity Loss from an ecological perspective, dams fragment river ecosystems. When a river's natural flow is blocked, sediment, transport, and fish migration are disrupted. This not only reduces biodiversity, but also alters water quality and temperature downstream. The fragmentation also affects wetlands, forests, and estuaries connected to the river system. For example, the construction of the Three Gorges Dam in China led to significant loss of aquatic life and increased erosion in the Yangtze River Basin. Similarly, small microorganisms and plants that maintain the health of the riverbed are often destroyed, affecting the entire food chain. 4. Balancing Development and Sustainability It's important to recognize that not all dam projects are entirely negative. With proper planning, community participation, and environmental safeguards, Hydropower can coexist with ecological protection. Techniques like environmental flow management, fish ladders, resettlement with livelihood training, and integrated river basin management can minimize damages. The challenge lies in implementing these practices transparently and in good faith. In conclusion, the story of dams is not just one of engineering achievement, but also of ethical responsibility. Every river basin represents a delicate balance of human need and ecological integrity. To move forward, our focus must shift from mere dam construction to sustainable river governance, one that respects nature, empowers local communities, and preserves biodiversity for the generations ahead. Thank you.